confirmation testimony of Gabriela Franco. I greet you with the peace of God, brothers in the faith. First of all, all the glory and honor be to Jesus. Watching so many shocking testimonies of visions, revelations given by our Heavenly Father by His Holy Spirit, I wanted to share the fourth revelation I had of this upcoming event. I was outside in my parents' house. I saw a giant gray ball that moved quickly, coming from west to east, about to make impact. I went inside my parents' house and I said to the family that was gathered together, Pray for mercy. The only ones who knelt down were my sister Karen, who's 18 years old, the father of my soon-to-be baby, and I. The others did not. Then I remembered that my baby's father stood up. So did I, and I said, now you will feel a quake, product of the impact of the asteroid, but do not worry, God protects us. A tremor then followed. Elsewhere, earthquakes will be monstrous. Once it struck, it was heard on television. The prophecy of the asteroid has been fulfilled. The asteroid prophecy was fulfilled. It also was on Facebook. Then I stopped to think of the prophecies relating to the effects after the impact, which be, will be catastrophic, grief, the pestilence because of the decaying bodies due to the three days of darkness, as a result of the great impact seizing the rotation of the earth, and many more things I thought. After waking from this dream, I kept thinking, lying down. I said, Lord, this is the fourth revelation you've given me. This will happen soon. Shalom, brothers. God bless you all. We are to settle accounts with God to ensure that before and during these events we will be under the shadow of the Almighty and that there will be angels protecting us, looking after us and our families. Blessings. As I always say, if someone does not believe, ask for revelation. God responds. Amen. Amen. Note from the page managers. For a long time, the Lord has been confirming this judgment, as well as his soon return, to countless servants, watchmen, children, people of all ages, even to non-believers and of many nationalities. Many of them had already received revelations, dreams, and visions before Ephraim Rodriguez or other prophets started to speak of this judgment. It is not possible that everyone has just come up with the same story. It is a judgment prior to the judgments described in the book of Revelation to prepare and cleanse the church for a pre-tribulation rapture. This judgment is not wormwood and it is not part of the great tribulation. This is what the original asteroid prophecy confirmed to countless souls declared. Even now, many of you who now hear this message have received dreams, revelations, and confirmations. You know it, and yet many of you have remained silent out of fear of the opinion of your pastor, congregation, family, spouse, friends, or because you prefer to think that it was all your imagination. Read Ezekiel 33 and sound the alarm. Seek the Lord while he can be found. Return to his arms alert and warn others. There is no hope for this outside of Jesus Christ. Don't trust that you will go in the rapture and that you will not see any judgment simply because you say, Lord, Lord. Many times in the Bible, God warned his people before his judgment so they would repent and be prepared. God is love, but he is also a consuming fire against sin and evil. Humble yourself before him and ask him if this warning does indeed come from him. We stand nothing to gain materially from this, brethren. This is for your own good, for your soul and that of your loved ones. Any future dates given in social media for this year 2016 or for the following years as the date for the fall of the asteroid do not come from this ministry. Please check all the links in the description box below the video, including an apology and explanation for the 2014 time frame date fail for the fall of the asteroid. 
If you wish to receive the prophetic documents related to this prophecy and its original message, list of supplies, prayers, flyers so you can print and distribute, instructions on how to anoint your home, biblical precedents of divine protection, and much more, please write to asteroidprophecy at gmail.com to request them. We will send them to you via email so you can print them out, photocopy, and distribute them. May God keep you. We love you in Christ and prepare, brethren, first spiritually by clinging only and putting all your faith in Jesus Christ only and then materially by stocking up on supplies, canned goods, food, medications, etc. Ask the Holy Spirit for confirmation and guidance through all of this. We love you in Christ. Amen.